Welcome back to the channel. Today, we've got some CWL attacks, but I'm going to use my lower accounts. I'm going to be using my town 11, my 12, my 13, and 14, and we're going to be doing Blizzard Lala on all of them. So first up is my town hall 11. And at town 11, you don't have to worry about the town hall, right? The town hall won't be fighting back, so you technically don't have to go take it down. But I'm going to see what I can grab, right? Because I'm going to go and grab the Eagle Artillery, the Air Defense, and all this value. So I'm essentially going to send my Lava Hound. But what you also want to do is think about like a circle. I'm going to do this for all the bases, right? So here's the circle. And I'm going to send my Hound in a straight line for this Air Defense because that's essentially what it, has to, what it will do. So the Hound will be dropped here. So that means we will drop the Balloon that's go or the blimp that's going to go for the Town Hall. So that's going to go this way. So this is where essentially our blimp is going to land. So we want to take out the Eagle, maybe this uh, Air Expo, all of this value. They may step up and grab the Town Hall. Nice, but it doesn't technically have to go down for Town 11. So what, that means carbon. Well, what about this clan castle? Well, we're going to deal with it on the fly with the poison spell. So if it's Electro Titan, please don't be an Electro Titan. But if we could take this area down. So what I like to do is think about it like a chunk of the pie taken out. Let's just visually represent this out. Now I want to use my heroes, my king and queen, to take out the enemy queen. Because I don't think the super wizards will take her down. So my heroes are going to be then responsible for taking out pretty much this section like this. So all of this... This black section should go down like that. And then the Lalo could essentially follow this path around like this. So we'll move our way around the base like this with the Warden ability. The only issue is we're going to have to worry about two multi-target Inferno. So let's cross our fingers and hope that it can go down. But either way, we drop the Hound and then the Blimp's behind. So the reason why I'm not dropping the Hound over here, right? Because if the Blimp lands, I could I go like this. But uh, I think the Super Wizards... If I, actually, now that I'm thinking about it, if, if I land here versus here, it's safer to go here. Hmm. You know what? I do have the wall breaker. So, you know what? I've changed my mind. Since there's an opening in this, I'm going to land, I'm going to go right there. Yeah. Let's do it. So let's go with the hound and then the blimp. Let's drop a balloon for that Tesla since it's right there. Let's go with an invis rage. All right. So now we should wall break our way in. Uh, oh. Okay, okay. I don't know why the wall... I don't know why the invis wasn't working. Uh, let's drop the archers here. Okay, super minions. Oh, we did pull out the CC. Oh, we did reach over the wall and get that. So that's actually good. CC will be able to be dealt with. Let's drop the queen. Let's drop two balloons and some minions right here. And then the queen like this. Poison the super minions. Let's go try to wall break here. King's ability. All right, he's going to go like this. We're gonna drop some more, drop a balloon here, test those. Let's go with an ice golem. Let's try to drop some wall breakers to break into here. We're gonna drop another balloon. I was trying to drop my invis spells, but they didn't work. So that means I'll invest my invis onto my queen because it's not worth it really for your Lalo. So now that I'm seeing where the queen's going, since she's actually making her way in, I'm gonna drop a minion there. I'm gonna let the queen walk up. So that means the Lalo is gonna come down the bottom side. So you can see how the plan is starting to switch. The reason why I'm lolloing from the bottom side is because the queen, since she could take out the top side, there's really no need, let me go and multi, uh, take that down, no need to send the lolo where the queen is kind of already going, right? So we can drop a minion here, which so the queen won't be able to reach. Then we can make the queen invisible. We can go ahead with another haste through here, and we can just do freeze that because there's only one balloon. Pop queen ability, and yeah. So you can see how standard this kind of was. We had the initial plan of lolloing from the top side, but since the queen ended up actually going up there, we switched up the plan entirely because why do you want to lolo where the queen's going to go anyways? So let the queen do her job, and then the balloons can take care where the queen's not going. So... That's why if you practice enough and you're able to uh, change the plan on the fly, then you can get really good and you'll get a lot more three stars because if you are saying, you know what, I got to stick to the plan no matter what, if I lolo to the top side, it still probably could have worked, but it wouldn't have been as clean. I wouldn't have been able to swag as many as he spells as the war's abil warden ability. But there we go, starting it off with the three star. Now let's hit on number 12, our town hall 12, I should say. And this one, of course, Blizzard Lalo. So what do we do? Well, we take out the Town Hall, right? Well, you know, on this base, I think I'm not going to go for the Town Hall. What's inside of my CC? Well, I've got the Super Wizards in here. 
And the reason why I'm not going for the town hall in this case is because if I take the town hall down, right, I may get some air expos here, but this eagle artillery is going to be really difficult to path into with the balloons and be very annoying. So we need to think about a straight line. So if we want the blimp, we're going to actually try to send the blimp over here. Let's see where the sweeper is. So we can try to just barely dodge the sweeper. But the key thing is we need to land this blimp right about here. Because we want the super wizards to take out this whole value, but then also check off grabbing the clan castle. You don't have to 100% take out the town hall with your bl blizzard at town hall 11 or town hall 12, because you could warden through it, but it's a lot more risky. But I'm going to go and land here. Uh, I do only have four super wizards, no barbarians, so it's a risk if there's a double giant bomb through here, but I don't think there will be. Uh, but granted, I don't know these bases. They could be anything can happen So we're gonna try to land take out this section right through here with our blizzard, right? Then we are going to probably send our heroes Around it depends on where the super wizards go Maybe around to try to get them to path this way into the town hall And then we wall break and then the king queen maybe grab the town hall or some of this value if They don't get the town hall where it's gonna be okay because we're gonna still send the lalo around this way So right so we go back to the circle planning circle thinking here if the blizzard is gonna kind of take out uh, Let's go with a Here let's say the blizzard's gonna kind of take this out just thinking about roughly like this our heroes are gonna take out like this uh, that's a lot of value but let's just think about it uh, abstractly and then we're gonna send the lalo around the base so pretty much like this so around the base like this and around the circle so it kind of flows around so that's kind of the plan so yeah let's go and give it a shot here we go all right so we go with the blint hound so straight line all right, we're gonna go with a hound and the blimp behind, and we're gonna drop like balloons behind because it's always safe to try to use balloons to pick this up. Oh, you know what I don't have is a rage spell. Uh, um, guys, take a rage spell. I have two poisons for some reason, but I think we should still be fine. Okay, we don't have a rage, but uh, can we go for the single? Come on, go for the single target inferno. That would be useful. Turn around. Go for the single, there we go. And I guess we can drop the king here. Okay, well, I guess we didn't need the ra <laughs> Oh, that was, uh, oopsies. All right, so we'll go ahead and use the poison onto this E-Dragon to slow you down quite a bit. Let's get the queen down here. All right, so the queen's gonna go this way. King's moving his way around. Go ice golem like this. And I'm gonna start the, uh, let's see, let's go drop another poison. I'm gonna start another hound or the hound here. I'm gonna try to, all right, let's drop. Ooh, I'm not gonna drop the warden just yet. So I'm gonna drop balloons over here, the warden like this, uh, like that. All right, queen's going around. So we'll just uh, warden ability over the town hall. Okay, here we go. King's ability, queen's gonna walk her way around. All right, move around. We still have headhunters, minions. Uh, this is fine, we got tons of freezes. Save some of these balloons. Just be patient. Just be patient. Let's go and haste you. All right, let's drop some you here. Got a lot of things near this town hall. Gonna freeze you, headhunters. This is to probably try to time this area here. Gonna freeze you again. All right, we got red air bombs. Freeze you again, warden. Go ahead and pop the warden ability through here to protect everything. Town hall goes down. All right, my queen's still up and around there. Freeze you. We can wall break this. All right, so that single target. Of, oh, that sing. Oh, okay, wait, hold on. I didn't wall break properly, but do I have enough? Come on. Single go down. There we go. Single goes down and there. So, like I said, you don't have to take out the town hall with the blimp. I was able to grab that valley. The queen ended up going the complete opposite side, but stuck with the plan of saying, yes, you can still just make sure you save that warden ability for the town hall. And you're still able to do it at town hall 12. In this case, I used the blimp to grab the core of the base because I didn't want the balloons to go there so they can loop around to be getting it done at town hall 12 here. And now town hall 13, we're going to take a look at number seven here. And again, Blizzard Lalo is what we got cooked. We've got the rage this time. Uh, 
Definitely want that with four invis. And we do have the Royal Champion, which is the bonus here, which is really nice. So if we take a look at this, I'm going to go for the Town Hall this time because the Town Hall is next to some other nice value. So if I can send the blimp with a straight line, right? So if we send a blimp here, that means we would land right here, right? We don't want that. We want to land right here on this yellow spot, which would mean that we would need a straight line that would come over here. So that's the difference. A lot of people make that mistake thinking that they would end up dropping like the blimp here and they think they would get here. But no, because it goes a straight line, you have to be very careful. So maybe use like a, a straight line edge or a remote, who knows, or your phone if you're attacking on a tablet or whatever you got that's a straight line that can help you or even your hand. But make sure that it's a straight line that goes from the town hall to the corner, right? So in this case, we're gonna we're gonna go like that. So that means we need to drop a hound that's gonna be pretty much right here. So it goes to this air defense. So the blimp goes, lands here, and remember, let's go and make the circle here. So if we got a circle, the blimp is going to take out this section right here. So this is gonna be the blimp's value, right? Blimp takes out all of this. Now we have our heroes. We have our king and queen and our royal champion. So I'm going to send my king and queen into an enemy queen or royal champion. This enemy RC may go down from the blizzard, but I'm going to send my king and queen into this section. So near where I got the value, so I kind of want to take out this section with my king and queen. I want to take out the scatter, the air defense, and hopefully maybe get close to the enemy queen. But then where am I going to send my royal champion? I'm thinking sending my RC down here. Because then I can get an archer tower, a wizard tower, another archer tower, another archer tower. That's a lot of value. So this section can be taken out with my royal champion. Now our Lalo could potentially fly in from the top side. Why? Because then we can get to the eagle artillery as fast as possible. We could also have the Lalo come over here. That's an option, right? If we're thinking that may be better on the fly. But the initial plan is to go into the eagle as quick as possible and take that down. So, without any further ado, let's go with the Blizzard Lalo at Town Hall 13. All right, so we're in. Got our rage this time. We gotta switch to our blimp. And we get our hound ready. And with a straight line, we go with a hound here and the blimp right behind. All right, let's go with a balloon to go for the Archer Tower. So, nice value there. Let's go in. Invis, Rage. All right, so double seeking air mines through here. Another giant bomb. Another Invis. Ooh, they're damaged quite a bit. Let's go here. Okay, they're going to kill the RC. We have only one more Invis. Come on, take out this town hall. Come on, come on. Come on, one more shot. And, oh, just got it. That was close. All right, so the king's going to make his way left. So we did kill that off the enemy RC. So king's here. Drop the queen. So you notice, right? We have this chunk of the base now down. All right, so that is good value. Now our heroes are going to the top side. So let's go and wall break like this. Let's see if we can wall break this wall open. Okay, just drop two more. Drop the poison spell onto these pups. And now that's open. We can drop an ice golem through here. And then we can drop a minion to clean up. And let's see, our heroes are gonna go to the top side. So let's send the RC into this cannon. And let's see where this king's gonna go. Minute 50, so we have to keep our eye on time. King's ability, they're gonna run up and around. All right, they're continuing their way through up there. And we're gonna send the RC ability. And she's gonna go to the bottom side, drop some more minions, queen's ability. And let's start the Lalo like this. So drop the balloons, balloons, more balloons. Drop the warden. Warden, don't follow the king, follow the balloons. All right, so let's drop the, uh, ooh, wait, hold on. Drop a few more balloons here. A hound like this. All right, let's go and freeze up this eagle. We make our way around. Let's go like this. And freeze up this scatter. And a few more balloons. Okay, warden, follow the, warden, follow the balloons into the core, please, my friend. And let's go ahead and pop the warden ability. Go and boom, pop the ability to protect the hound through the core. Drop a wizard down south. Eagle artillery is locking onto here. Let's go and freeze you. Ooh, it's not the best pathing. Let's see. The hound's flying across. This hound is going to be kind of clutch. Let's go and try to haste our way into here. Oh, no, they're going that way. We've got a lot of headhunters that are going to run across and try to provide some distraction. Eagle goes down. The defensive king. The balloon makes its way over there. 
The, oh, that single target inferno. The tassels are still up. Oh, dang, I waited so long. But uh, the king ended up pulling my warden a lot farther away. So let that be a lesson. Don't necessarily send your warden where your king is going, even if he's low health, because he will. the king will lure their warden around. And I guess the better spot would have been the lawless bottom side to get around in the end where there wasn't really any air defenses. So... Just wasn't the best pathing for my balloons. So, hey, you can't always get the three-star. It's a strong attack, but it's not going to get it done all the time. But the next attack that we're going to do, so 95, we came close, all right, is going to be our tunnel 14 versus this 15 here. So here is the 15 base that we're going to be hitting with our Blizzard Lalo at tunnel 14. So, um, okay. The plan's going to be we're going to have to sneak the blimp in from where? We got a sweeper here. We got a sweeper here. We're gonna wanna sneak the blimp in behind the town hall over here. So the only way to sneak it in is this straight line has gotta be over here. Is there an opening? There is. So technically we could drop the blimp right about here with the hound. All right, so if the hound goes to here, that means the blimp would go a straight line to the town hall. So we could, in theory, make it right here. So we can grab the Town Hall, the Air Expo, the Monolith, this, Bomb Tower, Scatter, the other Scatter. But then the Queen is going to hit the blimp as it approaches. So this is where I'm going to try to drop an Ice Golem to provide a distraction. So the Queen goes over here, then gets frozen while this is all going through, right? Where's the Queen's range? We have to be quick with it, right? We have to drop the Hound Blimp and then Ice Golem to distract the Queen. So if hopefully we land here. Then where am I going to send my heroes? Well... We take out this value, right? So we zoom out and we look at the circle, right? So we look at the circle here and we take out essentially, uh, let's color it with kind of pink. This section will kind of go down from the blimp, right? Essentially this area. So this could go down. So now we want the our heroes to run up to deal with the CC and then to also try to get the enemy RC. So we can probably hopefully grab all of this stuff right through here so that means our lalo will have to come from the bottom side down here but if i'm thinking about it this air defense won't actually go down the blimp will actually take this down so in theory this all will go down the air defense will stay up and so our heroes our king and queen will try to maybe hopefully loop them this way to clear this that means this pathing will still be up like this into this air defense so we'll lalo our way through here. But then this is a problem. It's air defense. Our hound's going to go from here down to this side. But this is where we could use the royal champion to create this. So instead of having to lalo like this, like this, down here, down and around, we use the RC to the bottom side, right? So if the RC takes out this, now that new lalo section is what? We go like this. We go like this. Now it kind of cuts off to here. Right? So this is the new Lalo section as we fly our way around and as the RC kind of clears this section down here. So hopefully you can kind of see how that makes sense. Well, at least that's the plan as I'm trying to do a 14 versus 15. But uh, we got our Ice Golem and uh, yeah, let's uh, hope for the best. So let's go. All right, we are in. So we got to be quick with it. All right, let's wait till the Queen gets to the top of her route here. We go with the... Hound, blimp, and we go with the nice golem here. Drop a balloon. All right, let's go with an invis rage. All right, let's see, can they step into the town hall? Go another invis. Okay, they're going closer to the town hall. We got this. Here we go, they step into the town hall. One more invis. So that's, oh, they died. Okay, the mile have stayed up. Okay. So let's go ahead with the king here. The queen headhunter. The poison. Oh, that monolith is still up. That's a problem. Oh, wait, what's in range of that? Okay, hold on. Let's see. So this is down there. King's gonna run. I, I need the monolith and or the scatters to go down. But now that they're not, this is, uh, this is an issue. This is an issue, guys. Here we go. Let's send the RC. Baby dragon to the bottom side. And we gotta start. So let's go balloon with the warden as we fly our way around. RC, more minions, another hound as we continue our way through here. We got the wall breakers as we make our way around. RC ability. All right, let's see. Let's go and try to haste, try to freeze this section. Oh, I 
that whoops that was an accidental uh let's pop the warden ability through here oh wait a sec because our blimp didn't get all the value we wanted uh let's go through here let's try to freeze up these scatters that monolith was yeah that monolith was supposed to go down from our blimp our blimp was supposed to take that down and if it doesn't it completely ruins the plan and yeah i mean well it is a 14 versus 15 and that monolith can literally you can see how much of a change that can do right there queen's ability will go off but it won't do it won't do much there drop a few minions down south and uh hey you know you can't get them all we tried dang it um that monolith the blimp i wonder was it a seeking air mine that took it down i could have used a warden ability but and no hound could have been an option but i thought the only way i could have had a chance at 14 vs 15 is if i was able to get that blimp all the way to the town hall to take out the scatters take out the monoliths but look out look how early that blimp landed right i needed it to get a little bit closer take out the town hall faster so they can backtrack but then they stepped into the town hall explosion and then they got taken out so it's been 24 hours and we're gonna fix this attack and you're wondering how are you doing it it's because i'm hitting on my other town hall 15 i built it so let's see we're gonna drop some balloons so balloons the warden and then the blimp gonna go all the way across we're gonna use the warden ability to protect that blimp and we want to get the scatters the town hall the monolith all of this so let's see here blimp you're gonna go and land raid boom okay let's step in to grab this town hall all right monolith goes down now they're taking out the scatter shot now they're going for the town hall let's go for another invis we have two more left quite a bit they're gonna step into here they're gonna grab this they're gonna grab the wizard tower and they can go for the enemy queen look at all the value that they are getting here it's absolutely wild so we can send the king over here on the left we killed the queen look at this so that was way better of a placement so let's go and send the queen let's go and drop a wall breaker through here let's drop an ice golem and let's drop another wall break into the single so the single's going into here since it's locked onto us here we will uh have to deal with this we'll pop king ability provide the distraction drop a poison spell a headhunter in the mix and then send the royal champion over here as well all right so as that's going through eagles actually the eagle's not activated just yet so we're going into the single so now we can drop a hound down here another hound some minions and we're just going to be pacing our way into this eagle artillery so let's go and freeze you another hound like this balloons let's go and haste into that baby dragon and rc with her ability potentially can path her way through pop her ability skip across and look at this the hound is still going drop some balloons we got the minions we got all this drop some headhunters and look on a stronger base i should have went to the left side but town 14 lizard lalo is really really strong still have queen ability still have a free still have an invis because of the valley so i chose wrong because uh, where i landed before i wasn't i stepped into the town hall so what the key was look where the blimp popped i had to pop that blimp far enough away from the town hall so that they can step take everything around it out and then step into the town hall to take it out because if you're too close to the town hall the explosion will kill the super wizard so you do have to be careful but hopefully you enjoyed this fix the fail of the 14 versus this kind of a decent level 15 but the base not too good